for better, for worse, in sickness and in health, is a vow some people take seriously as they tie the knot. For a couple in Chisasi, the period for good health ended five years ago. They're now dealing with affairs of sickness, which will ultimately get worse as they age. The worst has set in, and one of them has had to live up to the vows. And those vows are very serious. Eh? It all started with a fall. About six months, when she was okay. But later on, she developed a behavior, which we didn't understand. She was very excited, moving all around. Further consultation led him through different psychiatrists who prescribed medicines. I don't think whether it is medicine or not, but at one time, she just kept quiet. Abruptly, she kept quiet. Retired Reverend Canon Alfred Kwetisa calls his wife Mamushka and is surprised she has taken to me. You know she has loved you so much because otherwise she would have gone. He describes the 61-year-old as having been a very diligent and outgoing woman. Until when she developed a disease that she's struggling with. Mamushka. The Reverend is now resigned to taking care of his wife, was later diagnosed with frontotemporal dementia. What is dementia? That frontal part of the brain is used, for example, taking right decisions uh, at the right time, uh, especially about social habits. They get uh, disturbed very early in the onset of dementia. So this is a person who would undress, for example, uh, before people uh, or wants to, to ease self. Uh, and will just, you know, uh, do it where he or she is. According to Dr. David Basangwa, a mental health specialist and the E.D. Butawika Hospital, this is one of about 10 types of dementia, including Alzheimer's disease, which causes about 70% of the dementias in people above 60. By definition, dementia is a, a brain disease, which leads to slow but progressive decline in brain function, particularly in the areas of uh, thinking, and the uh, memory. Because when she kept quiet here, she forgot everything and she couldn't talk. As the dementia gets worse, uh, they lose the ability to remember, also to remember the words to use. I notice from time to time as I interview her husband that Mamushka breaks into this uncoordinated clapping. Yeah. She can do anything, she can clap, she can sing. Um, and surprisingly, she still knows the lyrics. He just cues her in and it all comes back to her. This, he says, works as therapy. Um, Dr. Basangwa says care for the elderly with dementia is an area many people don't grasp. Like you rightly say, they, they, they turn young, they turn like they are babies and they need to be handled uh, uh, properly. Uh, then they need to be supported to prevent, especially uh, they get prone to accidents. Uh, they could walk into a fire. The 68-year-old reverend has a side business dealing and selling of health products, but he usually operates from home. Most of the time I'm taking care of Helen. Does she recognize you? Is there a state where she forgets you? And I don't think she forgets me. Actually, when I am absent, she's uneasy. Dementia may not be prevented, but its speed can be limited and it can be modified. Things like uh, uh, lack of exercise would make somebody more vulnerable to developing dementia. So if we are able to make people more engaged in uh, exercises so that you increase uh, uh, heart output, uh, good diet that mainly comprises of uh, uh, fresh vegetables and fruits, uh, limited fat. Medication helps those already affected. When she wants to go for a nature call, she becomes uneasy. And if she wants, for example, to, to urinate, she can go out. Before she wouldn't, she would just do it here. And no one is growing younger. Professor Segade Musisi, a psychiatrist, says the training of the health workers doesn't focus much on neurological and psychiatric problems. So many of them are missed, or they're trivialized, or dismissed. It's not unusual to find even doctors laughing at somebody because they're forgetting. As long as you're aging, you're at a risk of getting dementia. It is within your interests to look after your dementing parents so that your children learn 
how to look after people who are old in society. The Reverend is hopeful that he will be spared because Mamushka needs him as all the children are away from home. She loves visitors, especially those with curse, and tearing her away from ours is a mini war, so we indulge her. Ronnie, our driver, gives her a thrilling ride. I think we get out. You have moved around. She really doesn't want to get out. Yeah. Helen. After the Reverend succeeds in getting her from the car, she eyes her other passion and doesn't hesitate to go to eat. When she finds a padlock, she knows that mm -mm, today I'm not leaving. But sometimes when there's no lock, she'll get out and she'll get lost. They are found the following morning because they, they, they went and got lost. They couldn't find their way back to, to the house. They couldn't open the door, for example, to get in. And in a non-forgiving society, which is also not well informed, many elderly are thought to be night dancers. Uh, others may just want to get rid of them, to get rid of, to get hold of their properties. But also remember that mental illness is very common in society, and uh, other forms of mental illness are also there. And the mentally ill also become old, and then you have a double stigma there. Mamushka still has a grasp of some things, like how we are around the compound. It helps if these people are not put into environments that are new and confusing. We are going to leave you, no, it's sorry. It's good, it's, good. it's okay. Another time. Yeah, another time. We are definitely going to visit again. As we leave, the Reverend has to muster some strength to restrain her. Florence Dalimba, NTV. Okay, bye.